When Nevaeh came into reading recovery, she really couldn't even read what we would consider a level one, which is just really holding a pattern through the pages of a book. Five weeks and 20 lessons into her series of lessons, she is now at level five, and the books don't have a pattern anymore, so already in 20 lessons she's made that transition from strictly patterned books to books that don't have a pattern. I can see the fish. I can see the big bird. Blah. Oh, thank goodness he got away. What, did we what we accomplished and attempted to accomplish for Navea was for her to do a, a few things. Number one, use what she knows to help herself so that when she comes upon a word that she has seen before, whether in reading or writing, she doesn't call it something else. Then the words that are unknown, she's sort of freed up to do some problem solving. Look where you are going. I look where... Keep going, babe. I think you're right. Where you are going. Our goal is to really make her independent of, of that extra, you know, so that she, um, she can function with the normal classroom instruction. She is at the class average and doing quite well, so she's exactly where she's supposed to be. She loves stories and is very engaged in stories, as, as you may notice. Creep, creep. Creep, creep. Through the forest. Hello, snake. We're going to hunt the terrible tiger. We're not scared of the terrible tiger. We're not scared of anything. We've been able to really work with her, just her emotional ability to encounter text and, and, and where she had perceived something as being really difficult and something that she wasn't encountering success with, to see her sort of engage and take on the task of reading and want to do that, I think speaks of a huge change in her from the beginning of the year, and I'm, I'm really happy about that. I did see lots of growth in Nevaeh. After she finished her reading recovery lessons, she was able to pick up um, more books on her own to read, and she enjoyed reading more. She had it in her head before that she just could not do this, and, and she felt much more comfortable picking up books and reading on her own and reading with her friends and reading to my class. Mom called, where are you going? Nowhere, why, what are you doing? Nothing. Why don't you go and play with your friends? I don't have any friends. I can't imagine where she would have been had she not had the intervention of reading recovery because she really needed that intensive intervention. I think she's proud of herself as a reader and I think that that builds a lot of self-efficacy that, that I can do this, I'm, I'm good at this, and so that, you know, then that does my heart good as well. She's made good progress. We just want to make sure that when she starts second grade that she has the support that she needs.